Bonjour everyone, my name is Noah and I have a new face. If you had not seen my haircut on Instagram yet, I'm sorry for the scare and I hope that you take some time to recover. As approximately 80% of the gay population who's currently on lockdown, I decided to either dye my hair or shave my head. So <laughs> this happened. As you saw in the title, I decided to be filming a quarantine Sunday vlog. Um, nothing crazy planned today. I just know that I struggle a lot to find things to keep myself entertained and busy um, since we've been on lockdown and I thought that maybe filming would be a good thing for me and also sharing some of my activities and hobbies with you might help you deal with your own time. You will notice throughout the day that I am completely unable to stop rubbing my head because it feels really good. Um, but yeah, so right now I woke up. It's kind of late. I went to bed pretty late last night because I was playing Animal Crossing until late. I am still in bed i'm reviewing the last version of the hawaii vlog part two which will go up in about an hour and after that i'm just gonna get up hop in the shower real quick because i cannot start my day if i don't shower or else that's gonna be a lazy day you already know um so i'm gonna shower first and then eat some breakfast and then i will reconnect with you guys <laughs> So if you follow me on Instagram, you probably saw that I decided that I was going to be doing the no shave quarantine thing. Um, this obviously only applies to the beard because the head got some serious trimming in the past week. But um, I'm out of the shower. I put on my uniform, which is basically a black tank top with black gym shorts. I've been wearing that basically every day for the past two weeks. I know everyone always says try to dress in the morning and like get ready as if you were going to spend your whole day at work but i just don't work like that i'd rather be comfortable and at least i have clothes on which doesn't happen every day but right now i just posted the hawaii vlog and i'm about to make some breakfast it's 12. i'm gonna make some banana toast so i just put like a piece of toast with some butter i cut up some bananas put some agave on top and some honey roasted almonds and i'm just gonna eat that i probably am gonna play some animal crossing this morning because i made some improvements in my house yesterday night and i really want to see how they turned out and also because my brother and his girlfriends have been wanting to visit my island so i'm, I'm just gonna do that So it is now 2 p.m. I ended up playing Animal Crossing with my brother and his girlfriend and FaceTiming them for approximately two hours. But they had a lot to show me. They visited my island, I visited theirs. It's insane, they have so much stuff and they built me some custom furniture. If you have no idea what Animal Crossing is, you're probably very lost right now, but you need to catch up because this game is just a really feel-good game. Right now, I'm about to do a little at-home workout. I've been following this fitness trainer on Instagram called Damon Bell, who posts a lot of at-home workouts that you can do with no equipment, which has been super helpful now that all the gyms in New York City have closed down. Today is Sunday, and I'm gonna do a chest-focused workout. He calls it hypertrophia because you only work the chest for the entire length of your workout so i'll put the link in the description box down below if you guys want to check out his page because they've been super super helpful in keeping me motivated and feeling like i'm on track with something and not just doing stuff in my own apartment now watch me struggle <laughs>
we're done. We did the whole thing. My chest is burning hot and I'm really sweaty, which makes me happy because it means I was actually working out. So I'm gonna head and take a shower and then I will make some lunch because I'm hungry and it's about to be three, so I should probably eat lunch. So I took a quick shower and started doing laundry because I'm running out of everything and put on a different pair of shorts and a different tank top. Told you that was the uniform this week. I was gonna make lunch, but I opened the fridge and realized that I basically am running out of everything that I usually eat for lunch or dinner or all the time. So I'm gonna go ahead and place an order on Amazon. Um, this is how we've been getting our food delivered, our groceries, we just order them on Amazon um, Whole Foods and then get them delivered. So we don't have to go outside since we're supposed to stay inside. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. And then I have some turkey slices left. So I'm just gonna eat that while I bake because someone sent me a recipe for cheesecake cookies on Twitter and they looked bomb. So I'm gonna go ahead and make those. I have all my ingredients, which are butter, brown sugar, white sugar, eggs, vanilla, baking soda, salt, salt and chocolate chips and of course cream cheese to make the cheesecake part i got almond milk cream cheese because we don't do dairy in this house but um yeah i have all my ingredients i'm preheating the oven at 3 375 degrees and i will put a recipe that i found online in the description box down below if you guys want to recreate those cookies but let me just let me just go ahead and ruin them let's let's just <laughs> Look what I found. I realized that Sal is a smart individual and actually purchased one of those. Oh, never mind. That almond milk cream cheese is actually it. If you guys want to try it out, it's called. Look at me being a beauty blogger. That's level one? What's level four? Six? No. There is a lot more fluid now, so I'm going to go ahead and start mixing the. No. No, no. So I forgot Sal's thing of putting pans in the oven as a storage place when we definitely- So it has been a little over 14 minutes now and as you can see, the edges are starting to be golden. So I'm gonna give it one more minute and then I'll take them out because I'd rather them kind of dry up once they're out of the oven than overcook. Okay, so I put them in a plate and they honestly look amazing. I had a little photo shoot with them. Look at that. Look at It's very fluffy. Let's try. I could keep eating because they're actually really good. The chocolate chips are not as melted as I wish they would be. So I don't know what I did that prevented that from happening. But the consistency is perfect. And they're really good. So I'm happy. So right now I'm just going to eat a couple. And I'm gonna just sit down and read a little bit of my book. I'm currently reading Aristotle and Dante Discover the Secrets of the Universe, which is a book that you guys recommended when I asked for LGBTQ plus novels on my Instagram story. I have a list of books, by the way, that you guys recommended. So I'm just gonna put it next, um, next frame so you guys can pause and screenshot and go through the list. Um, my favorite is um, Red, White, and Royal Blue, which was such a pleasure to read. I could not put the book down, um, and it just made me really happy. So if you guys want to check out any of those books, go ahead. But I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna rest for a little bit and read because I haven't read in a couple of days, and I miss it. Hi there, so it is 8.20 p.m. and I just woke up from an unplanned nap that I took on the couch right here. I think what I'm gonna do is make some beef quesadillas if we have ground beef, because I'm craving that for some reason. And then I need to wake up first. I feel so like drowsy. I wanna watch Tiger King, which is that TV show on Netflix that everyone is talking about, about that one, well, these few private zoo owners across the US that just mystery animals and humans and they're just horrible human beings. 
um, that I started watching last night. I watched like two episodes. Um, I'm kind of intrigued and everyone's talking about it on Twitter. So I'm going to see what that's about. Okay, so while I am watching this absolutely insane show that Tiger King is, um, I cut up me, me? I cut up my avocado. Um, I put some ground beef in a pan with some spices. And then what I'm going to do right now is take a crit pan and warm it up a little, not too much in low heat. And I'm going to take my tortillas and I'm going to just put them on there to warm them up a little. I look like an egg. What the f***? So I'm just taking my tortillas and just putting them on there. Just a few seconds to make them a little crispier and warm and toasty. Put some cheese on my warm tortilla and then I'm gonna scoop out some of that ground beef and put it on top. And then I'm just gonna grab it, flip the whole thing. Okay. And then because it's extra, I'm gonna put some more cheese on top and then it's ready to eat. We're just gonna serve it with some avocado and sour cream on the side. Here I am, I'm gonna try it out. So good. I think that's basically it for today's vlog. I'm gonna eat that and then watch a little bit of this craziness. Um, Carol is my spirit animal, by the way. <laughs> and then I'm just gonna head to bed a little early today because I have work tomorrow and I have to wake up early. But I hope you enjoyed this little quarantine Sunday vlog routine thing, um, that it gave you some ideas on how to keep yourself busy in this weird, weird time. But stay safe, stay home, and try to stay happy. I love you guys, and I will see you very soon for a new video. Bye. Don't shave your head. We look weird then. <laughs>